from the Law 27742. Bases and Starting Points for the Freedom of Argentines Articles 164-228 Title 7 Incentive Regime for Large Investments 3G Chapter 1 Creation and Scope of Application Article 164 The Incentive Regime for Large Investments Regi, is created for an only vehicle project that complies with the requirements here set, under which it is established certain incentives, certainty, legal security, and an efficient system of protection of acquired rights under its protection. The Regi will be applicable throughout the territory of the Argentine Republic and will govern with the scope and limitations established in this title and in the regulatory norms that the National Executive Branch consequently dictates. Article 165. It is declared, within the framework of Article 75, Section 18 of the National Constitution that the large investments that qualify and are carried out under the Regi are of national interest and are useful and conducive to the prosperity of the country, the advancement and well-being of all the provinces, the autonomous city of Buenos Aires and the municipalities, without prejudice to the legitimate exercise of local jurisdictions and competences, any rule or de facto action limiting, restricting, violating, hindering or distorting the provisions of this title by the nation, the provinces, by themselves and their municipalities, and the autonomous city of Buenos Aires, which have adhered to the Regi, shall be null and void and the competent courts shall immediately prevent its application. Article 166. The priority objectives of the Regi are indistinctly the following. A. To encourage large national and foreign investments in the Argentine Republic in order to guarantee the prosperity of the country. B to promote economic development, c. to develop and strengthen the competitiveness of the various economic sectors, d. to increase exports of goods and services abroad included in the activities developed in the Regi, e. to favor the creation of employment, f. to immediately generate conditions of predictability and stability for the large investments foreseen in the Regi and competitive conditions in the Argentine Republic to attract investments and that the same are materialized by means of the temporary advance of the macroeconomic solutions of investment without which certain industries could not be developed. G. To create for the large investments that comply with the requirements of the Regi, a regime that grants certainty legal security and special protection in case of eventual deviations and or non-compliance by the public administration and the state to the Regi. H. Encourage the coordinated development of competences between the national state, the provinces and the respective enforcement authorities in the area of natural resources. And I. Promote the development of local production chains associated with the investment projects included in the Regi. Chapter 2. Term. Qualified Entities. Article 167. The Regi shall be applicable to large investments in projects of the forestry industry, tourism, infrastructure, mining, technology, iron and steel, energy, oil and gas sectors that comply with the requirements set forth in this title. Article 168. The term to adhere to the Regi shall be of two years counted as from the entry into force of the present regime. The National Executive Branch may extend only once the term to join the Regi for a period of up to one year as from the expiration of the previous term. Article 169. Single Project Vehicles, VPU, owning one or more phases of a project that qualifies as a large investment, may apply for membership in the Regi. VPUS shall have the sole and exclusive purpose of carrying out one or more phases of a single investment project admitted to the Regi. Consequently, the VPU must not carry out activities or own assets not assigned to such project, with the exception of temporary investments of its working capital for the prudent management of the company's funds. The following entities will be considered as VPU. a. Corporations, including sole proprietorships and limited liability companies b. Branches established by companies incorporated abroad in accordance with Article 118 of the General Corporation Law, c. c. 
the dedicated branches provided for in Article 170 of the present law, and d. d. transitory unions and other associative contracts. Holders of concessions related to the execution and or exploitation of infrastructure works. And or provision, operation and or administration of services, which are in competition with other concessionaires, operators or providers at the local or regional level, may join the Regi if, one, they submit an investment plan that qualifies as large investments under this regime and two, they meet the remaining requirements and conditions for inclusion in the Regi. Likewise, suppliers of goods or services with imported merchandise may apply for registration in the Regi exclusively for the purpose of having the incentives and rights provided for in Article 190 of this law with respect to the merchandise, including inputs, imported for the service they intend to provide to a VPU adhered to the Regi. Said incentives shall apply exclusively with respect to the merchandise that was imported for the provision of goods or services to a VPU adhered not being able to apply it to merchandise that intends to be destined to other purposes. If the merchandise is imported for the provision of goods or services to a VPU and the supplier cannot use such merchandise for the provision of goods or services to a VPU adhered to the Regi, either because it has not been selected for a tender or because of termination of the contract that gave rise to the provision, or similar cause, the beneficiary supplier must inform the authority immediately and request the withdrawal of the destination of the merchandise before being able to use it for another destination. As from their registration, the suppliers must invoice annually, in concept of goods sold and or services rendered and destined to the VPUS registered in the Regi, a percentage in relation to their total invoicing not lower than that established by the authority of application. Application at the expiration of each calendar year, the supplier shall report such percentage to the authority of application as a sworn statement, accompanied by a certification issued by a certified public accountant. If at the end of each year this condition is not met, the supplier will be automatically and automatically suspended from the use of the incentives of Article 190 for the time established in the complementary resolution of a general nature issued by the authority of application. After the second suspension, the authority of application may order the definitive cancellation of the supplier. During the suspension, the goods that have been imported with the exemption of Article 190 shall continue to be used exclusively for the rendering of services to the VPU adhered, and the provider shall inform the authority of application as required by the complementary resolution. Non-compliance with these provisions by the service provider shall qualify as an infringement under the terms provided for in Article 211 excluding subsection F- dash, according to the infringement applicable at the discretion of the authority of application, and shall make it liable to the penalties provided for in Article 213. 213. Article 170. In those cases in which a corporation a limited liability company or a branch of a company incorporated abroad wishes to adhere to the Regi and develops one or more activities that will not be part of the investment project, or has one, one, or more assets that will not be affected to such project, Ike may opt, for the sole purpose of its adhesion, to establish a branch that shall comply with the following requirements. a. Be registered in the public registry corresponding to the place where it is located. b. Obtain a unique tax identification code and register for the taxes corresponding to the activities it carries out, independently of the company to which it belongs. C. Have an assigned capital. D. Have designated ASITS sole purpose the development of the investment project for which inclusion in the Regi will be requested. E. Have assigned only the assets, liabilities and personnel that will be assigned to said investment project. F. Keep separate accounting records from the company to which it belongs. The adhesion to the Regi and the incentives included therein shall only be applicable in relation to such branch. Article 171. Those who, as of the date of accession and or the date on which the application authority must resolve the approval of the investment plan pursuant to the provisions of Article 177 of this law, 
form and integrate a VPU and are included in one or more of the following cases, may not apply for inclusion in the Regi. A. Those convicted, with conviction confirmed in second instance, for any type of crime under Law 27401, or whose partners or shareholders are in such situation. B. Those declared bankrupt under the terms of Laws 19.551 and 24.522, as amended, as the case may be. C. Those convicted, with conviction confirmed in second instance. Based on Laws 23.771 or 24.769, as amended, or under the criminal tax regime of Title IX of Law 27.430, as amended, or under Title I, Section 12 of the Customs Code, Law 22.415, as amended, or under the criminal exchange regime of Law 19.359, Confer. Decree 480-95, as amended, as the case may be. B. D. Those who have firm, enforceable and unpaid tax, customs or social security debts. E. Legal entities in which, as the case may be, their partners, administrators, directors, legal representatives, trustees, members of the supervisory board or those holding equivalent positions therein, have been convicted, with conviction confirmed in second instance on the basis of Laws 23, 771 and 24.769, as amended, or under the criminal tax regime of Title IX of Law 27.430, as amended, or under Title I, Section 12 of the Customs Code, Law 22.415, as amended, or under the criminal exchange regime of Law 19.359, Confer. Decree 480-95, as amended, as the case may be.